Hey folks, today I've got something crazy to tell you. If you think Iran only makes missiles, you're totally wrong. They've built a system that blinds enemies before they move. It's called the Sayyad 4 Electronic Warfare System. Mind-blowing stuff, seriously. In this video, we're diving deep into this beast together. What it is, how it works, and who built it. We'll explore how it jams GPS and shuts down comms. Even the Minister of Defense showed up, so stay tuned. All right, let's break it down from the very beginning, friends. Sayyad 4 is a fully homegrown electronic warfare system, super slick. It's designed to disable the enemy's navigation systems and GPS. Basically, it throws off their accuracy and scrambles their brain. It's loaded with smart gear, receivers, analyzers, and powerful transmitters. It detects signals, analyzes them, and then hits them hard. It's like a ninja hacker that jams the enemy mid-fight. All electronic, all stealth, nothing flashy, but totally effective on battlefield. Now get this, the most epic part? Women designed this system. From A to Z, Iranian female engineers led the project. They unveiled it at a defense industry expo for women. Only a scale model was shown, for classified security reasons. The real system is sensitive, so it wasn't fully displayed. Even the small model looked terrifying. Massive dish, armored truck setup. They hinted it mounts on heavy tactical platforms like 8x8 trucks. Definitely something that can operate in rough zones and long range. No official numbers yet, but we've got decent estimates here. Based on similar systems, its jamming radius is very large. Could be 100, maybe 200 kilometers, or even more. That's enough to blind drones, aircraft, or incoming smart bombs. And it doesn't stop at GPS. Oh no, not even close. Sayad 4 probably targets radar, comms, and other enemy frequencies too. Any signal it catches, it can fry or confuse easily. It's like turning off enemy vision while you stay hidden. So why build Sayad 4 in the first place anyway? Main goal is to protect strategic sites from enemy attacks. When guided bombs or drones come in, they need GPS. This system makes sure those bombs hit absolutely nothing useful. Every modern weapon, drones, cruise missiles, smart bombs, needs satellite guidance today. Once Sayad 4 scrambles that signal, the weapon completely loses course. It might fly back, crash, or just go totally offline. Sayad 4 basically creates an invisible dome around key facilities. It's not just a defensive shield, though, not at all. Sayad 4 also goes offensive, disrupting enemy communication lines actively. From command centers to frontline radios, it can kill all chatter. Imagine enemy units panicking with no one to report to. War nowadays is all about who controls the invisible spectrum. Whoever owns the electromagnetic space has already won the fight. Sayad 4 is built exactly for that dominance. No bullets needed. It blinds, deafens, and traps enemies in total confusion instantly. Now let's talk about the official unveiling. Yeah, that was something. It happened on December 10th, 2025 in Tehran's Expo Center. The event was about women in defense industry. Super inspiring. And guess what stole the show? Sayad 4, loud and proud. Defense Minister General Nasir Zadeh showed up and gave high praise. He said women are working shoulder to shoulder with the men. They're designing, building, innovating, the backbone of Iran's defense tech now. He even said it's just the beginning of their role. There was also a not-so-subtle message to foreign observers. If our women can do this, imagine what's next. This wasn't just tech display, it was full-on strategic signaling. Iran's saying, we're not playing, we're fully in this game. Media coverage was wild, especially the secrecy around the real system. Everyone kept saying, they only showed a small-scale model. That's how seriously Iran guards its electronic warfare capabilities right now. Even showing the mock-up sent shockwaves through defense analysts. Let's compare it to some global EW systems. Fair's fair. Russia's Krasuka 4 is a beast. 
range of 150 to 300 kilometers, Syad 4 seems comparable, especially with similar anti-satellite signal interference. This puts Iran in the elite club of EW giants. Or take Turkey's Koral system, used in Syria and Libya. It's mounted on trucks, made for jamming ground and air radars. Very capable, very modern, but Iran's Syad 4 isn't lagging behind. Regionally, Iran's catching up or possibly overtaking in some tech. Inside Iran, you've got the Cobra V8 for radar jamming. It works on enemy aircraft, blinds their detection systems mid-air. Syad 4 complements that, goes after GPS and communication systems directly. Together, they cover radar, satellite, and everything in between. Why is Syad 4 so strategic? Let me explain easily. In today's wars, signals matter more than soldiers or tanks. If you can blind the enemy's eyes, you win early. Syad 4 does exactly that, without launching a single rocket. That's what deterrence means, making the enemy think twice first. When they know their tech won't work, they stay away. Syad 4 gives Iran invisible firepower, more dangerous than seen weapons. It's the new face of defense in modern hybrid warfare. The war in Ukraine proved how critical EW tech really is. Everyone's jamming everyone. GPS is the first target always. Take away positioning and drones just crash or fly blind. That's exactly the role Syad 4 plays for Iran now. So to those who think Iran only makes missiles, think again. This is high-tech, signal warfare, space denial kind of battlefield dominance. Syad 4 is saying loud, we'll blind you before you blink. Even your satellites won't help you, not in our skies. But maybe the most inspiring part is the women behind it. Young Iranian women building elite tech with zero outside help. You can't watch that and not feel national pride surge. This isn't just science, it's soul, determination, and fierce creativity. All right, friends, if you've stayed with me till this point, thanks. Now you know what the Syad 4 electronic warfare system does. If you enjoyed this breakdown, hit that like and subscribe. Until next time, stay sharp, stay curious, and peace out.